So our hope is on this 21 day journey of fasting and prayer, we not only want to encourage you with these video devotionals, we want to provide opportunities every weekday at 6.30 a.m. The Vineyard facility is gonna be open and we wanna invite you to come and pray, come and press in with uh, the people of the Vineyard and to see what God might actually do in your life and in our city. As you fast and pray, lean into what Jesus says about your prayer and fasting. He says this, and when you fast, do not look gloomy like the hypocrites, for they disfigure their faces that their fasting may be seen by others. Truly I say to you, they have received their reward. That's Matthew 6, 16. Now he's telling us a couple things very clearly. First, he's saying, when you fast, meaning there is an expectation that as a follower of Jesus, fasting is a regular part of your life. So if this happens to be your first time to really fast and pray, Welcome to something that is considered normal as part of the Christian life. Now, secondly, you're not fasting for others. Jesus says, do not look gloomy like the hypocrites, for they disfigure their faces that their fasting may be seen by others. Now, you know what that means? Don't tell people you're fasting. Don't slyly mention that you're not eating lunch because, you know, you're fasting. Oops. Clearly, you're fasting much like your prayer is to be done in secret. Now also, when you fast, he says there's a reward. Now, not a lot of clarity what the reward may be. It may be a deeper humility for you. The reward may be a restored relationship. Reward may simply be a greater awareness of God's presence in your life, but there is a reward. However, if you fast and reveal to other people to gain their praise, Jesus says that is your reward. So today, fast and pray in secret, knowing that God will reward you.